Morning so soon. Beautiful, beautiful sunrise. Well, I am going to run outside. Get some fresh water from the stream. Let's see, what else are they gonna do here? Um Yeah, we need to get a garden going. I need food. I'm surprised that Yeah, I haven't like been super hungry or anything? Why can't I? Oh, I can't get that fence. Well, that's actually a good thing. Now that I think about it, you really don't want that to be able to happen. I'm not gonna get on my roof, though. You know what? I need a ladder. Ooh, or... Entrance from the inside. That'd probably be wiser. Do I really want to build this up as two stories? No, no, I don't think that. But it would make for a nice little platformed area up there. All right, so that's the agenda. Move this clutter. So much, so much clutter. I don't know. Really like, what kind of weirdness has to happen for these just continue to exist? Gravity not affect leaves. Right? Can these leaves just live infinitely without anything providing nutrients and substance for them? What kind of weird world is this? I just I don't understand. I really don't. I feel like such an all died by this, and yet it doesn't. I don't know. Sometimes some things just seem strange out in this wilderness here. But, this will let some light to go on. Maybe that'll, uh, improve growing conditions. I see I got a lot of grass growing over here. It's... This is gonna take that back. I think I can't be seeing planting Ooh, speaking of planting trees. Where did I put those saplings? I didn't put them in here, did I? Yes, I did. Pine saplings. Um, I don't know what happened there. I can't put that in there. I need to go out and plant some pine trees. And I suppose some normal trees, too. They wouldn't hurt. But let's, uh, let's be a little smarter this time with planting. Let's not plant them someplace where... Ooh! Yeah, let's plant them... Here. How did I never see this before? Seriously, that is amazing. Or did I see that and I just didn't care? I don't know. But that's definitely something to go exploring in a day or two. I don't necessarily want to have too many trees. But we do need to think about sustaining here. As I don't know when I'm actually to get off on this game show. That was one thing they were vague on. I think my... my Oh, by the way, I don't think I'd mentioned. Today is day seven. I went through and I counted up the recordings and this is my one week anniversary. So, yay to me, I've lived a week. Um, I don't know if those guys expected me to or not, but I have. And on that note... That means it's five more days. They gave me this letter and said, Don't open this till day 12. That was almost the kind of voice they used to. But not quite. Um, I was like, um, okay, guys, whatever. I mean, sure. If you don't want me to open it till day 12, I'll, I'll wait till day 12 to open it. So, day 12 is coming up. And with that means I get to open this letter, which. Honestly, I have no idea what it's going to say. I'm assuming it's got something to deal with, you know, like, how I successfully finish. Because I'd have to imagine that, uh, 
they're going to need me to to do something so they know to come pick me up. I mean, I don't know what, but it would seem to make sense that you know, if you're you got a guy doing a game show, you're going to come pick him up at the end of the game show. And to do that, you're going to need to know, you know, when to come pick him up. So you're not coming too early or too late. Or maybe there's someplace I need to travel to. I don't know. They didn't give me a compass or a map. So I, I guess I could build a compass. How hard can it be to make a compass? I mean, it should be doable. But yeah, so I really don't know what I'm looking at here. Other than, uh, other than day 12, open up this letter and go on from there, I guess. Because that'll tell me, it'll tell me something. I really don't know what it says. But we'll find out. And then, uh. I guess we'll go on from there, because I don't know, again, I could say anything. I mean, it might be something like, hi, ah, you're a dummy for doing this. We're letting you die out here. Which, if that's the case, I'm telling you, these guys are going to have another thing coming, because I will find my way back somehow. Even though they dropped me off here from a helicopter. And I was blindfolded for the entire trip, so I actually have no idea where in the world I am. But I will find some way to get back, and I will make these guys pay dearly. If they're just going to leave me out here. But, I can't imagine that would be the case, because they did, after all, say this was for a TV show. And you're not going to have much of a TV show if you never come and collect the video. And... Unless I'm mistaken, I'm the only person that's got a copy of this video. Because I'm not wirelessly transmitting the data to any place. And yes, I do never share facts. I, <laughs> I probably shouldn't be saying this because this is probably like against contract or something. But um yeah, I broke open the, the camera. I, I shouldn't say I broke open. But, you know, like, I opened the camera case up, and I read all the stuff on the camera. And you know how any kind of a device that has a wireless transmission has to have an FCC stamp of approval. Saying, like, FCC says this thing's not going to cause interference. You know, this is the kind of antenna it has on it. All that kind of stuff. You know, and just, it's normal, normal stuff for any kind of electronics that has a, an antenna in it. Nothing like that on this camera. So I am 99% sure these cameras are not transmitting any kind of data wirelessly. Also, if they were, I don't know where they would be transmitting to. Because Wi-Fi only has like a a 100 foot range, I think. It might be a little further out here because there is really no interference other than some trees here and there. So you might get a little further range. But still, when you think about it, that would mean there's somebody else out here who's following me around to pick up the data from the video. And I'm pretty sure that's not the case, because I haven't seen that. And I have to imagine that if there was somebody out here, I would have seen them. Or, you know, seen footprints from them. Or seen some litter that they left behind. Or anything. You know, you, you just, you would have seen something. And I've seen, almost fell off the roof there and broke a leg. I have not seen ah, anything. So, it, well, it very much so leads me to believe that nobody is out here. Which means I'm the one that has a copy of this data. Which also means if they want it, they have to come get it from me. Which pretty much that they don't have. Alright. Clean up the yard. Still looks like a mess, but whatever. I 
time to get some wood. Get some Let's go. These trees are fast. I don't really need branches. And leaves. Let's help these things die. Okay, so I need two chunks of wood to make the corners. Yeah, so that's two. That'll give me some planks. I need to put a door out back. Go into the garden. Which I might just put in here. I don't know yet. So two of those have to be reserved for that stuff. Um, let's just run out there and I just want to get this taken care of right away. Uh there we go. I just want to get this taken care of. So I can at least be done with this. Boop, boop, boop. And boop, boop. Perfect. Okay. So now I have a little rift, or a fence in, I guess. Can I up on the roof? Nice, nice. Um, really does need some means by which to illuminate it because it's dark. When it gets dark, it gets dark. And I need some kind of lighting. So it's not so dark. If you haven't noticed, darkness is kind of a thing here. Okay, I think this is what I'm going to do. Smash the glass. Smash up this wall. Put in a door. And that's going to be how we get to the garden. Perfect. Alright. Another successful day of surviving. Uh, apples here before we go. Drink the water. And I will see you guys in the morning. Um, man, you just you can't accomplish anything. There's not enough time. It takes so long just doing this piddly cleaning stuff. It's horrible. I almost wonder if I couldn't just burn it all down. Would that be would that even be a smart thing? I really have no way of putting a fire out. I pretty much have to make sure it's contained to a point where the fire's not going to jump and then light it up. But then I'd have to have a fire. Oh, man. The, the problems you... The problems you run into when you're cast away by yourself in the wilderness trying to survive, trying to build yourself someplace. Aww. There's fireflies out. Um, because you guys probably don't care about fireflies. I'm going to go to bed. And I'll see you guys in the morning.